Hello, I am making shrimp scampi, but instead I'm using whiskey instead of the vermouth. So right here, I took a stick of butter and approximately 30 shrimp that were frozen. And I have it actually cooking in a skillet. And I'm going to show you the process which is, notice how it's foaming up. That's what you want to do to give the shrimp a bath with the butter to make it cook. And as a lot of you may know who have cooked shrimp before, you want to get it to that pink stage, but you don't want it to be fully cooked because you're going to make the scampi and then um, put it back in to um, the butter mixture once you've put the butter mixture with the fireball whiskey and all the ingredients, um, you're gonna put the shrimp back into all that and then cook it some more. And right here, I put, let me get my little towel here, so I don't burn myself. I've got my um, asparagus steaming, but I put some olive oil in there, some Himalayan pink salt and some pepper and it's steaming away it's actually almost done and I got a new steamer that is heavy-duty special rubber but it's for cooking so I'm gonna actually shut this off now and let that cook um, with the lid on and um, I'm gonna go back to the shrimp and I'm gonna stir that a little more yes this is me hello and I'm going to just stir that around. You know, the smells are wonderful. I wish this had smell vision The asparagus steaming is amazing. And I put actually pepper and the Himalayan pink salt in here with the butter, as I mentioned before. And that smells divine. Um, and what I'm going to do is, is show you right here. I've got my mixture which is a take on the, sh the uh, scampi side of it I've got one and a half lemons <coughs> excuse me one and a half lemons